Three of the four England players who missed training today belong to Chelsea. John Terry was feeling poorly. He went down with a light illness last night. Frank Lampard had a dead leg and Ashley Cole had a battered leg from a late challenge in the Tottenham game. All are expected to be fit for the game at Andorra on Saturday and England travel out on Friday. So only training today from a Chelsea point of view were Wayne Bridge and Joe Cole both looking to be part of the team obviously under Fabio Capello. Well, there's everyone away at the moment, just about. Uh, Petr Cech's gone, even though the Czech Republic don't play away to Northern Ireland until next week. And on Friday, Michael Essien's Ghana are away to Libya. Then on Saturday, the real action begins. The French Florent Maluda and Nicolas Anelka are in Austria. The Portuguese four now in the squad for Portugal, of course. Uh, Jose Basingua, Ricardo Cavalier, Paolo Ferreira and Deco. They're away to Malta. Serbia with uh, Branislav Ivanovic are at home to the Faroe Islands. And oh, on Sunday, there's more action. Uh, Salomon Kalou will be with the Ivory Coast. They're away to Mozambique. Um, and uh, next week as well, Germany are away to Finland. They're actually playing on Saturday, but they're away to Finland. And Michael Ballack has yet to be ruled out of that game with his foot injury. Germany hoping that they can get him fit for their second game of the international break. But the big news, in a way, is that so many players are involved in under-21s inter internationals in the coming week. Chelsea have four players uh, called up. For England, Michael Mancian is joined by Ryan Bertrand, his first call-up, the 19-year-old left-back who's been out on loan for just over a year, and uh, well done to him. Also, Rhys Taylor with Wales under-21s, uh, they are away to Romania, and Miroslav Stock with Slovakia under-21s are at home to Belgium and away to Iceland. Elsewhere, transfer deadline news. Only one a former Chelsea person involved. Alexis Smertin, his contract was terminated by mutual consent at Fulham. Good luck to him. Uh, we don't know what he's going to do next. But otherwise, no ins, no outs. Nothing to report.